Good morning everyone. Welcome back to the vlogs. We are here in London as we left you from yesterday's vlog and what we ended up doing was just walking around in the morning. We grabbed a bite to eat and then the cleaning lady that was cleaning here after the first guest left. We're staying at an Airbnb, so there was already a guest here this morning. She had to clean, so we kind of just walked around a bit, and it's so beautiful here. We are staying in a part of London that I've never been to before, like I've never stayed here, but I do know there's a lot of parks around and really cute shops, and we're still gonna be going into central London and stuff because I've never been here with Dan. You guys, could, you guys could tell if you watched yesterday's video we're in the same clothes because it's, yeah. like, it's like 15 minutes later Later. So we're still in the same clothes. Yeah, because we just unpacked and then I've been editing. And yeah. Now we want to show you guys around our place. Yeah, I'm. I filmed a lot on my vlog too, but I'll still give you the same tour. So basically, it's a very white theme um, Airbnb, which is super cute. I love those boxes, by the way, and the big windows. They have like a lot of nice, like their little decor thing. Yeah, that's like what I love. Like when really, I saw it online, really I was like, nice I love stuff. this. This faux fur rug, the white floors. The big mirror. We have stuff, our stuff put away in there, and then this thing is really cool. This is the kitchen and the fireplace, which I don't think we can use. I don't even think it's a real fireplace. I think it's just like a whole Yeah. Wall. Then here's a balcony, and I'll show you guys the bathroom. Really simple, but cute. This is my absolute favorite. This? This big, like, island countertop mirror, yeah. like rustic looking wood. Yeah. I love it. I like that couch too. Our stuff is just everywhere because we're kind of in the middle of unpacking. But how cute is this room? Like, this just fits my Insta aesthetic so much. Like, if I was living here, I would put paintings. But, like, the ceilings are high. Look at the thing on the... Ugh. It's very, very nice. And I love this so much. I was telling Dan I really want one of these for our house. But we can make this. We can steal it. Dan. I'm kidding. No, we can't. <laughs> I love it. Once Dan's finished editing, I think we're going to go for a run or something and uh just try to keep ourselves away he keeps yawning like crazy i slept fine i did not so we got to keep you awake i slept like maybe 45 minutes last night as my sleep and the night before that i only slept like four and a half hours because i couldn't i couldn't fall asleep till after two and i i always get up at seven to go to the gym so i'm pretty freaking tired right now Ugh, sorry why are you yelling but I'm right, really freaking tired. I'm sharing the video right now, and then I'll start uploading it. And once I see how long it has to edit uh, to upload, then we can just go. Cause it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, it's a little rainy outside, but that's fine. Oh my gosh, how nice is this for videos? I didn't bring a tripod. You have one. A mini one, but for my main channel videos, I didn't bring a tripod. We'll set it up. Remember in Paris, we set it up on like the freaking coat rack with a book. And, like, at least I have some sort of a tripod thing. Yeah, you have a mini one at least. Yeah, I could put it on this for sure. Okay. So as you can tell, guys, it's still kind of crummy outside. Oop, oh, look at all those kids coming home from school. I noticed that everyone here, or it looks like a lot of the kids are wearing suits to school. I guess that's normal here. But it is clearing up a little bit, so we're going to head out pretty soon. We want to go to the grocery store to pick up some food because we have a fridge here. We can cook some stuff. Uh, but I'm really liking the decor. The more I look around here, the more I see things that I really, really like. Just like little, little things. Here, let me see if I can find a few of the things. I love this little thing right here. It's so wooden and it fits really nice with the decor. This little Buddha statue. I think it's Buddha. I don't know, but it's really cool. I like that. And then I like this chandelier wind chime dream catcher kind of thing. I don't even know what to call it. I think it looks very cool. We are heading out because the sun came up, yay! So we are going to a vintage store that I really want to go to and our Uber is just about here so we need to rush out. I don't think it's that warm out. Even though the sun is there, I'm still gonna be dressed warm. But I then, took off my sweater. Yeah, you're all pat, you're like summer. <laughs> I'm hot blooded though, so like when you're <laughs> cold. Like, I'm cold blooded? Yeah, well when you're cold, I'm like, what are you talking about, it's so hot. Oh my God, yeah, we're opposite. And then when it's hot and you're like, oh, it's so nice out. I'm like, I'm dying. <laughs> So we came out to do some shopping, guys. We just went to Beyond Retro, but we didn't see much of anything that we liked. So we're gonna stop at Starbucks. Maybe get a hot chocolate, because Alex is cold. Mmm, soy vanilla chai latte. Alice. Alice in Wonderland. Oh my god, I just filmed your forehead. <laughs> wow, look how freaking beautiful this is. Yeah, you. 
but even this like the scenery it's so cute and it's so busy my god yeah it's because like school's out on like an evening probably works out so it's, it's almost six yeah people going to get get a beer after work yeah. hanging out cool so we are just walking towards what store are we going to now it's got the name but it's another vintage it's another vintage one didn't you say like Rickett or Rick, Rigid? Rickett? I don't know, whatever. I'm not good with store names. I don't really know anything about fashion. Where? Oh yeah, he's so cute. I don't know if you guys can see it that far in the vlog. Jeez, look how busy this is, it's so cool. There's so many people. I love it. Oh, and I love this car. That's sick. Popeyes fish and chips for a first time being here in London. I love it so far and I probably should be walking on the sidewalk But I'm trying to dodge people I Find it so cool that people are literally just standing around outside the pubs with a beer Just chatting like just hanging out right after work or after school I think that's amazing like the trust that the pub has that they're not just gonna leave and just like the whole cultural aspect of that I, I think that's amazing. It looks so cool. Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. This is where you can see the play. So we came to Rocket. That's what it's called. Vintage store. We'll see what they got. Wow, it's big. This is good. Snazzy. How does it look? Does it look nice? Yeah. I like it's it. It's so cute. So Alex got a beautiful leather jacket, bomber style. Well, it's pleather. Pleather. Which is what? Like fake leather. Mm -hmm. um, and we'll show it to you guys when we get back to the house. Right now we're looking for like a drugstore pharmacy type thing because we have a few like toiletries we need to pick up that we didn't pack. Yeah, I didn't bring shampoo and conditioner. Yeah. So we got to go find that stuff. And then after that we have to find something to eat because it is currently 6.30 and I'm starting to get pretty hungry. So we're back at the Harry Potter building but I didn't notice how gorgeous that entire building is. My god, beautiful. This seems to be one of the busier squares here. Lots of people hanging out. Lots of traffic, lots of cars. Cross quickly, go. Oh. That car almost hit my leg. <laughs> so we got some shampoo, conditioner, and soap. It's starting to get dark out and we're trying to find somewhere to go to eat. Where are we going, Nando's? Yeah, so Dan's never tried Nando's. I obviously don't eat meat, but there's like other things I can get there that aren't. That aren't meat. Yeah. And she Fine. says it's good, so it's well, hopefully it's gonna be good. It's not okay. <laughs> I wanna consider it like fine cuisine, but for like uh, something quick, like. Well, you know me, I like. Portuguese chicken, chicken that's like quick. Like I like almost all foods, so we should be good. So this is what I'm talking about with people just chilling outside the pub having a beer. Look at how cool this is. Everyone's just hanging out, enjoying their time after work. It's so awesome. And look at this, another one that's super crowded. And then we made it, we found it. So let's go have dinner. So I got the butterfly chicken breast with peri salted chips and the macho peas, which look really freaking good. And Alex is just getting the, the chips, so we're just waiting for that. Mmm, that was actually really good. I enjoyed that. Thanks, Alex. Thanks for bringing me. I thought it was pretty good, and they had a bunch of sauce you could add, too, on the side. So I was dipping it in some spicy garlic sauce, which was actually really tasty. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to go check out the Harry Potter place and see if we can get tickets to see the play, because that would be pretty cool. We don't know if you need to buy them, like, months or weeks in advance. We're going to see if maybe we can buy them for, like, tomorrow or a couple days from now. Because I think that would be super cool if we catch that show. All right, we made it back now, guys, and that cab ride on the way home was literally like this for me. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> that was the cab ride on the way there, too. No, 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 just like every two seconds. And like the radio and the commercials and stuff, I was going like in and out of dreams, and then I'd wake up and like think about what was on the radio. It was so like delusional. Uh, so we're gonna go out for a walk again. So guys, what do you think? Oh yeah, let's see her leather jacket. 15 bucks. 15 bucks or 15 pounds? Pounds. Wow, it's so nice, babe. I wanted something oversized. Love it. Really cute, yeah. Looks good. I'm such a man. No, you're not. It's in style for girls now. It's cute. I feel like Buffy the Vampire Slayer. 
<laughs> I had a steak, and my hair was like, you know how she stuck her hair in the ponytails with like the two straps? Yeah, yeah. But yeah, go for a walk. Maybe get another something to eat. Probably just get like a water bottle. Uh, just because it's 8.15 right now, 8.17. So just to push it like another hour. Keep it going just to stay up a little bit longer. Because if I can sleep like from 9 to 5, I'll be okay with that. But if I sleep now, I'm going to wake up at like 3 or 4 in the morning. That's too early. Too early. Guys, I made it. It is 9.44. I survived. But I need to go to sleep. Alex is gonna go take a shower. She's also drinking water right now. I just forgot how to swallow. <laughs> She's trying to take a pill. And, I'm like, what? Down and she swallowed it wrong. <laughs> but uh, when she gets back from her shower, we'll say a quick good night and then uh, probably end the video. Okay, good morning guys. I fell asleep last night. I just finished editing the video from yesterday. Well, the, like editing this video right now. And I don't even remember filming that and saying that I'll see you guys after Alex's shower, but I just completely fell asleep. She said after she got out, I was just unconscious on the bed. Uh, so we'll do a question of the day for this morning. So I'm gonna look for it here in the comment section from yesterday's video. I answered a whole bunch already, so I do know there are some questions. All right, she's back. And the question is actually from two days ago, because yesterday it hasn't been up that long, so I haven't found any questions in the comment section. And the one from two days ago comes from Jessica D'Souza. And she says, Dan, I remember you used to be a bit camera shy when Alex used to vlog with you and now you're completely comfortable in front of the camera. How did you get to that point? How do I answer that question? I don't know. You could say maybe. All before. him. <laughs> um, I don't know. I think it was just practicing and doing it more often and getting more comfortable with it. It's sort of like anything. You know, I always say when you, when you get out of bed first thing in the morning to like walk to the bathroom, you don't even think about it, right? You just sort of do it because you've done it so much and you practice it. So it's the same thing with anything. Like if you're nervous when you're first going in for a math exam, if you've done a ton of math practice and you've done the questions a million times, then you're not going to be nervous because you've done it. So I guess it's the same sort of thing with vlogging. But yeah, I'm still kind of loopy right now because I woke up at three. <laughs> Guys, I'm not even jet lagged. <laughs> I'm like perfectly fine. I went to bed last night. I don't know what time did we fall asleep. I fell asleep well, like right after I vlogged. And I said it was I, no. I said it was 9:44. So, like so I right probably fell asleep around 10:15, 10:30, and I woke up at eight. Yeah, good for you. Well, I woke up at I woke up at three because I had to pee and then I couldn't fall back asleep. So I'm gonna finish editing and then we're gonna head out for the day. So we'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Hope you guys enjoyed our first day here in London. And subscribe if you want to see the rest of our London trip. <laughs> oh we'll God. see you guys tomorrow. Bye.